time has arrived for one of our featured attractions. Ever since this match was announced, wrestling fans of all ages have been buzzing about it. First time anywhere ever, Greg Murray, the Moon Dog, the DFB, the new battle with the Evil One, the VOZ, right here tonight. And VOZ in this building, the Fusion Wrestling, with an unquestionably sound win loss record among one of the very best. Teacher Student Clash. What an awesome opportunity this is for Greg Murray. He's been waiting for this matchup ever since he has started training with Steve Boz, head trainer at Chicago Style Wrestling. It goes without saying, top franchise player of the Chicago scene for decades, over three decades for Steve Boz. And Greg Murray avoiding the fist of Steve Boz and instead trying to turn and rotate that left arm and wrist as well as he can. But notice how quickly BLZ grabbed the top rope. And Mr. Television trying to let the official know Kevin Woods as well as BLZ that there might have been a hair pull right there. You know that when Greg Murray starts barking, the whole crowd in the same exact succession and synergy will do the same thing. And obviously the popularity of Greg Murray at Fusion Wrestling ever since his debut 13 months ago, the fans really enjoy watching him in the ring. Very entertaining, known for the Temple of the Dog Slam and the incessant mace. Greg Murray getting seen across the circuit. Well traveled. Exposure on internet pay per views, but Steve Boss could care less about that. He's going to try as often as he can. Smash that jaw and put a hurt into the moon dog in this ring. I don't think Steve Boss takes Greg Murray seriously. But he certainly will once he finds out what he's all about. Nice counter right there. Boz was trying to escape that arm bar, but Greg Murray, he rolled with it, and down went Boz right there. Hans Carden, the last win for Moondog. Very impressive victory there. But this is an opponent with a lot more experience and a lot of weapons. He also has Mr. Television on his side, and that, in my estimations, makes this a very difficult challenge for Greg Murray to handle. The one-man advantage for the BOZ is significant. The experience advantage as well. What the heck? Mr. Television just grabbed at his ankle, and look at that! Blade attack from the high! BOZ chopping down the, the moon clock right there. BLZ, one of the most accomplished in Chicago and pro wrestling history. An arrogant individual who will do whatever it takes to win at all costs. Mr. Television with a cheap shot. The insults that this individual, BLZ, has made to those that are out of shape. What? Man, he deserves some karma, this BLZ does. Verbally tearing down those that don't deserve, that don't measure up to him in the wrestling business. BLZ has ruined wrestling careers. He has taken several of the young prospects and he's humiliated them. He hasn't bursted their confidence. He's, he's put them in positions of weakness. And he's defeated people soundly. And he's cheated to win matches. Murray trying to swing for the fences. There's a nice over the top elbow smash. Oh, he tried to grab that one. What happened there? The leapfrog and Boss collapsed. His left knee gave up. And B.O. 
Jones, he has a history of some problems with that left knee. He's had that knee surgically repaired more than once. Mr. Television very concerned. Kevin Woods checking the BOZ. Now this is now up to the official. If he wants to stop this match, he can. BOZ pleading for help. Murray helping BOZ up. I didn't hear a bell. I think this match is still ongoing. Wait a minute! He sucker kicked him! Save him the Savant kick! He wasn't hurt at all! That was wrong! How evil is that? High flying leg drop. There's nothing wrong with his leg. Who are we kidding? Murray kicked out again. You can't trust Boz at all. He'll say one thing to your face and he'll turn around and he'll say something else. That's what he's all about. He's two-faced. Doesn't treat his opponents like equals. He just verbally tears them down. He insults people. And then he cheats the win. He got out of the way. Murray, Murray with the roll-up. No way. BLZ too strong. Spin kick, very low. To the inside thigh. Snap suplex. And Greg Murray, who's been involved in some very difficult brawls, hardcore battles, and more, I don't think he's ever met an opponent quite like the BLZ. He knows every trick in the book. Watch this. The leg drop again. It's a go to move. It's a wear down hold. Murray's head and neck. Get weaker. This match goes on. And now the fans starting to bark like dogs around here. Murray wound up and missed the elbow drop. Suddenly, Murray's got a chance. The opening is here. Can he win this? Murray much improved. Since one year ago, he can entertain the masses passionately, can wrestle virtually any style. And he wants to prove tonight he's got more fight than fart. What a clothesline! There's an elbow! Well, Murray, fight his way to the biggest hit on his career. There's the temple of the dog slam! Oh my, BLZ got the shoulder up. Two count only. Murray a little surprised. Did not expect that to happen. And Murray says he's got one more of those. Lined up for the BOC tonight. Take this arrogant individual and knock his lights out. Oh, what a counter. Beautiful spinning head scissors. And now, the BOC. The famous sir. All the weight on the back of Murray's head. Man, he almost cracked his skull at that drop. And somehow he kicked out. Maybe out of instinct alone. The evil one, BLZ, a little stunned and winning. Well, this match just continues. Front face lock. Spins him around. And Murray kicks off and put it right at him. Left arm. Nice combination. The takedown. The elbow drop. Can Murray win it here? No. Too close to the ropes. The ring awareness of BOZ, top notch. If he's anywhere near those ropes, he's going to grab them. He's going to put his leg on. Watch this. Twisted cross body on the way down, and Murray barely kicked out in time. That's how quickly BOZ can shock and surprise you with a counter. Shake, rattle, and roll. He spun him out of space. Flyliner down for the count, and Murray again won't give up. The moon dog is here with a purpose at spring break for Fusion Wrestling. And for now, I don't think many would have been
anticipated that Murray would have put up this much of a fight, but he is. And Murray on several occasions almost beat BLC so far. Watch this. Twist the feet denied. Murray! Spinning power bomb! Boss wasn't expecting it! Oh, again! The shoulder popped up. Two and a leg, twelves. How close was that? Murray thought he should have won this match. And Murray could make his dream come true if he could hit the incessant base, the flying knee drop off the top rope. He's going for it all. Watch out, Eric. Boss is a sitting duck. What the heck is he doing on the apron? Get Mr. Television down. Come on, Rev. That was his chance. Wait a second! What the heck? The low blow! Kevin Woods didn't see it! What is BLZ doing? That could be it! Spinning twist of fake cutter! Look at the outside leg! Posing for the crowd! And that's it! The dream of the student being the teacher! Not at spring break tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner. He's better than you. He's the evil one. B. O. Z. Give the assist to Mr. Television. I think Murray would have won this match. A low blow might have been the difference. And again, the BOZ has broken and violated an infraction of the rule book to get away and look at this warm embrace for Mr. Television after the match. Do something about BOZ and its reprehensible actions. Very evil, but very effective. BOZ wins.